Hey, what's going on, guys? I just got back from my LFS, the Wet Spot Tropical Fish, with two more monsters. These cute little fish are not going to be cute for long. Gotta go ahead and uh, get these guys acclimated as usual. Two more monsters for the monster tank. They will become monsters. They're, they're not monsters yet, but boy, they're gonna become them, so let's go. Hey, I hope you guys are all doing awesome. If you could click the subscribe button and notification bell, that would be awesome. Man, did you guys see those spot face pikes that I picked up? If you guys haven't, I will have it in the end screens for you guys to check out. They are amazing. Yeah. Chilling, chilling, waiting for those fish to acclimate. We're here uh, checking out some of the Lepturus Green. Got some Lepturus Green Fry, parents, all kinds of goodies. All kinds of goodies. Oh yeah. Hey everybody, so I got some between one and two inch hawks and eye biters for sale. Um, you can see that they're, they're all over an inch. Um, Maybe inch and a quarter. And then down here, more hawks and eye biters. And these guys are about an inch. Very close. These ones are bigger for sure. These ones are close. Uh, I have them for sale. I do ship. If you guys are interested, PM me and I can give you guys the details. All right, let's, let's release these cute little fish that are going to be monsters. There they are, two peacock bass. Looks like two different kind. Have to wait until they're bigger to know for sure. All right, here we go. Here are the peacock bass. Working on trying to get these guys to eat. Uh, threw some krill in there. Gonna see if that's gonna do anything for them. Man, this is super exciting new fish for me new fish in the fish room something i've never kept this is pretty awesome if anybody's got any ideas of which species uh, these are be awesome these are wild caught from my lfs pretty sweet yeah these were the only two species there two peacock bass in the monster tank There's the pike down there. Yep. These bass are small, but I think they're gonna hold their own. I seen the one with the long horizontal stripe. He was going head to head with the, uh, the knife. Pretty impressive for a small fish to go after the big knife. Man, I love these pike. Little peacock bass swimming by the cave of the pike. This dude's awesome. Here we go, here we go. Just watch. 
They're gonna say, get out of here. I guess not. When I was watching them, the pike would come out from underneath the driftwood and they would chase the bass out. There's that dude. I have a feeling once I get them on food, they're gonna really start to grow. Ah, there's the pike. Going after something. Peacock bass, really excited to see how these guys grow, how fast they grow. Look at that gorgeous spot face pike. Wow. I am definitely digging those spots on this bass. Sweet fish, man. I can't wait for these guys to grow. Yeah, what do you guys think of the skate? It's nothing special, but what do you guys think of the skate? Ooh, yeah, look at him go for that. Piece of krill from the big fish chewing it and, you know, some spot pieces coming out. Who else just likes watching these fish? sit there in one spot moving their fins around or just stay in that one spot. Let's feed the bass. Yeah, that little guy got it. Nice. Go with another piece. Yeah, there you go, bud. He went and picked it up. Yeah, you can see that he spit it out just there and then it looks like the pike went after it. It's interesting, it seems like they're afraid of it. Interesting. Yeah, get it. You can see they're on the left side, one of the bass, boom, going after that piece of krill again. Nice. Yeah, I know it looks like a lot of food there because it is, but the knife usually always hides and the pike are also you know, hiding underneath the driftwood and stuff. So they kind of come in and out. And especially when someone's in front of the tank, the knife kind of just chills in the top corner of the aquarium. The pike will come out, but this food's gonna get eaten. It's just a matter of me getting out of, the, out of here so they come out. Yeah, guys, there they are, the peacock bass. Uh, if anybody has an idea of which ones these are let me know in the comments uh feeding them krill uh they seem to go for it then not go for it um they're picky so i'm gonna have to continue to continue to experiment and see how they do there's the knife We've got the uh spotted spot faced pike some extra food in here i'm hoping that once i leave the room they're gonna go after it but uh, we will have to see. There, there they are, guys, the peacock bats. Bit of a rare occurrence, the knife, gold-spotted knife. Don't see him too often, so he's hiding. So there we have it, guys two wild caught peacock bass that I got from the Wet Spot Tropical Fish, my local fish store. And uh, these guys are gonna be absolutely epic. I'm gonna have to get a bigger tank down the road, especially for these monsters. They're gonna need a bigger tank. Now, if you guys know which variant those peacock bass are, please throw those in the comments. I would really appreciate to get an idea of what they are. Also, if you guys have any tips and tricks to entice them to eat flakes and pellets, that'd be awesome. They do chew on the krill. Um, I have had a couple feeder fish that they have eaten as well. I wanna try to get them transitioned over to uh, flake food and pellet food. So if you guys have tips and tricks and ideas, please leave those in the comments down below. So what do you guys think I should add to the tank next? So far we got the Lima catfish, gold spotted knife. We got the red Atabapo pike. We got the two peacock bass. And then we have the three spot face pike. I'm trying to think of how to say the, say the scientific name, um, but I'm gonna butcher it because I gotta learn it still. But that's what we got in here so far. What do you guys think we should add to the monster tank? Uh, I love pike, I think they're super awesome. Um, a Zabrina would be sick. 
but we'll see we'll see but uh, yeah guys thanks for watching the video if you could comment like share the video subscribe and click that notification bell I'd be honored for you guys to join me and be notified when we got another video coming out because we got a bunch of stuff on tap a bunch of stuff in line so thanks again for watching hope you guys enjoyed this video talk to you guys soon stay tanked